The man is an absolute genius. The Scottish Express goes full steam ahead. The magical nine down leg. Oh, huge response from Gary Anderson. Middle of the bed, no problem. Brilliant from the flying Scotsman. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the action. This is the Boyle Sports Grand Slam coming from the amazing city of Wolverhampton. It's all brought to you by the Professional Dance Corporation. We are live on Sky Sports. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to meet the players. Making his Grand Slam debut, Streaky Dave Arletti. And ladies and gentlemen, a two-time Grand Slam finalist and a two-time champion of the world, the Flying Scotsman, Gary Anderson! Dave Paletti had an anxious moment there where he thought he'd lost his darts, but he put on stage for him. After all the talk about women in darts, talk male now, because Royal Mail is a postman, Dave Paletti. Won titles in Wales and Romania this year. Made his debut at the BDO World Championship in January as well. Taking on Gary Anderson, last year's beam finalist. That amazing match against Gerwin Price. Paletti Anderson, he commentators Devin Peterson and John Park. Thank you, yes, and we are ready to see what Dave Perletti can do at this Grand Slam event against uh, Gary Anderson. We're not quite sure what we might get from Gary. We know he was the finalist last year, lost to Gerwin Price, and we've heard all about that. We know what he's capable of, but what will he bring this year? We know he wants this. He st says he wants the title. It's one of the titles he doesn't have, and I'm sure of all the titles he doesn't have, it's the most important. There we see runner-up in 2011, 2018, last year, as I just said. And, uh, well, whether he's in his fine form or not, I think that Parletti's got his hands full here, Devin. Yeah, no doubt. I mean, Parletti will be, will be enjoying all of this. I mean, he was quite nervous, quite excited. He's just reveling in all the emotions that he's had. And then playing a great, like, Gary Anderson, I mean, He's a he's a, a loving legend in, in, in Scotland and, and just Firstly, pushing the game as far as he can. But Gary Anderson hasn't been Gary Anderson game for the on. last beginning of the year um, for 2019. So we've not really seen a lot of Gary Anderson, if I'm honest. But yeah, let's see what Dave Parletti versus Gary Anderson cooks up for us today. Yeah, and another Easy thing is one. when we have seen Gary Anderson, we haven't seen Gary Anderson a lot of the time. Uh, it's been a bit of a struggle. But that looks good. It's the consistency, though, isn't it? Easy. When you're rusty to playing 110 averages, let's say, you can't afford those second darts, can you? Yeah, it's just, it's just not Gary Anderson-esque. If his first darts in, I mean, he's, he's always running through and, and you expect him when he's in. But I think with, with the game against Dave Parletti now, it might give him some time to settle and get that first dart in. And that is more like Gary Anderson over here yeah. with his first 180 <laughs> of the match. I mean... If you wanted anything to go by, I mean, is Gary Anderson back? I don't know. On his first 180, I mean, it's his first time for the game as well, so, yeah, Gary Anderson might Listen. be back. Well, well, Dave will be thinking Gary's back. <laughs> you know, that's the last thing you want to see is Anderson starting to hit 180s. 95. I mean, you're going to hope, like anybody that's going to play against Gary Anderson now, you're going to hope he's not on. Right? You always hope a good player's not on, just for a start. 
no matter how good you think you are, who wants a harder job? There we go. That's what you have to do. Both players first tallies 180 on this game. And he just... 138. Dave Parlett, he might succeed in this game, like as he not win it, but enjoy it to the fullest. And it might just relax him a bit more because he's thinking Gary Anderson is playing really well and 90. I'm not going to have Gary a chance Maguire, and eight. that might just bring out his best game. Yeah, well, the doubles are always a separate issue. That's a great one uh, to get in next to, and he does. Gary Anderson. Yeah, that was a so very useful Gary first start, although it wasn't in. Gable. It's a first break of throw as well, and we know in this first first of five, I mean, a break of throw is like gold. 100. So Gary Anderson setting off, and then all he's wanting to do now is hold. He looks comfortable though, John. I think I think his first starts in his target, and like you said earlier, when Gary Anderson's 60. turned up, we've not seen Gary Anderson, and hopefully we we get to see him today. Deflection on that one. 97. Oh, you want to catch up if you're Parletti and get a 140 here. The 180 would be even better. But that's the job done. Stay in pressure by being shot for shot with your opponent against the throw at least. If you're not, if you're not staying in the same range, you're it letting your, your opponent hold his throw too easily, I think. Yeah, correct. I mean, make him work for it, especially when when you've lost your throw, um, especially with the, with the finishing as well. Just giving yourself that, even if it's one dart, at least you got a chance. But giving him six darts, uh, a single double, you are kind of just giving the game over. Yeah, it's one thing that your opponent holds his throw. It's another thing when you haven't pressured it. It, it really is. And that is the second maximum for Gary Anderson, and he sets himself up on 67. Yeah, he's laughing him in now, Devin. <laughs> That's a new way of hitting a 180, laugh it in. Yeah, well, if you as talented and as gifted as Gary Anderson 60. is, I mean, you can probably 67. throw backwards as well. And Gary Anderson steps up here for 67. First up being 17, he wants his favorite tops. 67 the and the Gary second Anderson. leg, he's held his throw there. The Gary reverse. Anderson, the train is back. One hundred and forty. Fifty-eight. There we see that near ton average of Gary Anderson. Perletti just about 90. And of course, uh, he's getting to the point here, Perletti is, where he's starting to think, wait a minute now, I need a leg, and I think this is a good one to get, or I get to face a whitewash, which pretty much is an elimination event if you were playing in a round robin here. Yeah, I think, like like we were saying earlier, that every point counts. I mean, going, going, the O must go in in all your games, and and that's the first thing. The first job is to get a few points on the board, even if you're going to be losing. Ninety-three. But I think that where where Palet is now, he's got at least six starts to get this one six three, and I think he'd he'd see that as an opportunity as well. Yeah, he won't be happy here game. though. In that position, you don't want to leave yourself a ton plus finish. You need to make it easy on yourself. Get some scoring done in that visit. The setup turn, setup play in general is very important. But now, Anderson with the finish. This 104 has to go. And he's missed the single 12. So 43 left. 72. Oh, sorry, 35 163. was left to leave the 32, yes. I knew we needed three. <laughs> 96. Dave Parlett, his first 32. chance of putting the leg on the board. His first dart at a double. Three in hand on 32. He wants two eights. Still wants two eights. Doesn't fancy it. 
Yeah. 16. You can tell the expression. It's just seeming like hard, hard work. And of course it is, because you know you can't afford to miss. This man will pepper that double. Gary Anderson waves the tops away as he that was the leg that I wanted. Game on. And he looks quite focused though. He looks like the old Gary's back. That's all you want though. Yeah, and not the old, old Gary who missed the doubles before he was a world champ, but the world champion Gary is back. He's hitting this doubles well. Paulette is looking like he's settling as well, slightly. I mean, his, his darts are going in not as straight and scattered as around, but as we watch Gary Anderson throwing his third 180 for the match, and we're only in the fourth leg, so he's back to, he's back to playing dominating darts as he used to. Still, 100. a decent effort from Parletti here against the throw to try and get his first leg of the match. And you have to be in it to win it. 135. Never truer than when you're playing against Gary Anderson because he's not missing his doubles. Nor is he missing the treble, John. So it's, it's, even, it's even worse. I mean, Gary Anderson that played in the World Series, 100. this is not the same there person. And he's averaging 102. At this point in time, and he wants 129. He's gonna leave 16 and lead tops. A favorite tops. Paulette is looking like he's gonna need to take out this 161. And the first start has to be perfect. Plum in the treble 20. As requested. As requested. Bullseye! Oh, well, that would be more left. painful had it left a hole in the 50, wouldn't it? Yeah, <laughs> yeah you just think that, that was the one chance. But the favorite top three in hand, you'd fancy Gary Anderson to take this in the center Gary of the board. Anderson. Gary Anderson Good leads 4-0, um, averaging 101. Gary Anderson's playing really well. I mean, his percentage on doubles is 67. I mean, it's as good as we know Gary Anderson to be. I think that Dave Parlett is now just going to be resigning to the fact that he's going to have to enjoy this game instead of, of kind of fighting back and thinking. Well, it's a big leg for Parletti. Just get that one leg even. Yeah, and then you hope Pretty. that Anderson hammers the other guys in the group equally, right? And, and it gives you a chance. And, uh, just any leg, just something to grasp onto moving forward here. That's the beauty of the, of the group Sixth games. Thing. I mean, if this was a knockout, Parlett is out, he's packing his bags, but now he's got two more games to go, and, and this yeah. is what his, his opportunities. I mean, yeah. it's one, not Six one game off. It's, it's just he's got two more to look forward to. Yeah, he's got every reason to contest this leg right here and now to keep this match going. 44. It's not a matter of, oh, I can't win five straight legs against this man the way he's playing. It's, it does That doesn't matter. He can win this leg, can't he, if he just... Gets his head down, and it will mean all the difference. But look at Anderson, just passes Barletti by 25 points there. One hundred. Didn't leave a finish, but he's done well. He's, he's keeping in there, keeping his hopes alive for this leg at least. 81. He's going to need at least just first yeah. dart in the treble and second dart just scaring it like another one right there next to it. Yeah, he needs that setup play he didn't have in the other leg. Yes, and Paletti sets it up at least giving him one shot at the double. Gary Anderson on 191, so no chance to finish. 59. And he's not done anything there. But Dave Paletti is going to at least get two darts at a double, yeah. It's two darts in hand, top left. Double ten. Hey, He's got the double ten. The old must go. Paletti gets one Game point on the board. And uh, a bit of joy there for him. A little smile. And why not? You deserve it. You know, it, it would have been pretty hard on him, I think, had he lost that leg in the end. And uh, a little unfair to his effort. Really, I, think I, I applauded, as you did, his 180 in the, in, at the beginning 60. of the match. And, the first leg, they both had a 180, and really, it, it, it was a good sign he wasn't going to roll over. It hasn't worked out that well so far, but 28. he's here to play. 
Anderson just throwing a 28 slight little switch off thinking about going home, resting up for tomorrow's game. And is this is this the, the resting that's coming in or is this another 180? It's probably just the rest. Yeah, 100. it's rusty. Only a ton. <laughs> yeah, it's is pretty basic i think right now in his head that he just feels okay i'm just going to run this leg out probably Ooh, in eight or nine away. darts even he doesn't need to go out in six from here hypothetically he could need to but take a 180 and a 158 out for parletti to stay keep this thing going can he start it no so anderson comfortably to go Get his first game here, five one, Devin. Yeah, I think Parlett is just designed the fact that he's got the one on the board. He's got a point. He can settle in, come back tomorrow, 48. and just go at it a lot harder. Playing against Gary Anderson, first game. I mean, he's not won a game on the on the on the stage on the on the televised tournaments, basically. And yeah, just playing against Gary Anderson in your PDC event is is it's a lot to go on, but he's done well. He's got the one point on the board. He's looking to set up just in case Gary Anderson misses. 174. Is Gary there a twist in the tail or will Gary Anderson take out tops with two darts in hand? Game, shot, and, the match. and Gary Anderson, Anderson does indeed do that. First start at the double. A finishing display by Gary Anderson with three 180s as well. Gary Anderson gets game one of his group.